welcome to everything we do fun. So uh, while we're busy with a lot of things, Prophetess Yenka reached out to disaster victims in Malawi and um, she took some relief there. You know, when I was watching that video, I just remember how daddy used to reach out. When I mean daddy, I mean Prophet Tibi Joshua used to reach out to people all over the world. And um, I was so happy. I was so happy because um, daddy has planted a seed on the ground that we can only sit and wait and see what the seeds are going to grow into. The world will be touched. The world will feel the love of Christ on earth. This gives me joy because when people see us, they should be able to see God providing for them. They should be able to see the kindness of God in our eyes, in our acts, and in whatever we do. And I am so happy with the fact that Prophet Yenka has taken to reach out to these Malawian women, you know, um, that have gone through this disaster and to give them some sort of uh, relief. It's really, really uh, touched me in a way that everything begins to come back. But this goes to show that the legacy lives on. So for us to ensure that this reach even the more world, like daddy would say that whether you planted, whether you water, we are all doing God's work. I would like to say that if you watch this video and you touch, go to www.prophetessyinka.com. That is her website. And you can be able to see how you can be part of this God's own grace mission that is taking over the world. They are coming. Time for tears has finished. Time for healing. It's ongoing. But that notwithstanding, the work of God needs to go on. Continue to pray for them. They are praying for you, but they need your prayers too. Continue to pray for them. Continue to pray for Mommy Evelyn. The job is big. Like Jesus said that the harvest is plenteous, but the laborers are few. Let's just embrace each other and support each other so that we can do God's work. God's work is much. Please go to www.prophetessyinka.com and you can see how you will be able to be part of this mission. She has not sent me, but I have seen this video and it touched me. And because it touched me and I know that there are so many information on her website. And I saw that this is what all of us should be part of, you know. She alone cannot do so much. She can go a mile, but we can support her to go 20 miles. So jump on the ship, watch this video, and do let me know what you think in the comment section. What comes to mind when you see that truck driving to that village? It just reminded me of what Prophet T.B. Joshua has done, and he has left a fantastic legacy that will speak until the day Jesus comes. Having said that, this is where I go. I will see you again when I see you. Bye-bye.